Max. Prove yourself. Get that purify off, but they did see that that Iron Man is missing, and now they are diving the tower down a bottom lane. Talking of which, Exotic Gear is gonna fall. Uh, get the lift. Especially the Hill Troll lifting up Boogie, sending him back, and now he uses a clap, but I don't think he gets out of this one. And there's a blast from Kaysaw just to finish things off. And Boogie goes down. Meanwhile, in the middle lane, we got some rotations coming in. The cooldown is there, but the damage from Weeha and DNZ, Nisha, he's just gonna TP himself out of here. Iron Man, meanwhile, getting caught out by Patos. So actually, they really need Gyro to get like an item first before they can even fight this. It's sort of like Flat Cannon being good, but. Witch Doctor might be in trouble. Lane, yeah, it's gonna be the Witch Doctor who falls. When he, use, when he uses true form, gives plus 100 damage at level 3. So oh. skeletons, good player, might well be caught out here, stunned up, nuked down, but DNZ might be the return. Uh, oh, does that affect the... Oh, it certainly does. Plus 30% damage on the familiars, I mean, hitting for 38, but they attack so fast, that is going to make a huge difference. Oh, kill the top lane. Yeah. Oh, we're just going to Jesus, look at it. Is oh, that wow. an epi I hear? Yes it is, they're going pretty hard onto Weeha and they do take him out. The split comes through from the Brewmaster, meanwhile the Snowball coming through onto Nisha. Can they bring down this Gyrocopter DNZ taking too much damage the Tusk Falls? There's only one Brewling left, where did they get 500 off? Uh, <laughs> good player. Yep, Death Ward committed. Bring him down quickly. Uh, meanwhile the top lane, Exotic Deer, Patos, Kaysor. We're looking to put on some pressure as well. Now the rotations, I mean, we just finishes off this tower down here and they're also able to defend their tier 2, oh, but wow. the epicenter coming through and they take down Boogie. They didn't get him last time, but they certainly do this time. Last, the gyro nuke damage at this um, I'm probably, I'm hoping that Visage gets a pipe here. I think he's got the dollar crystal. Oh wow, they managed to kill the Omni. Yeah, top lane, they get Omni and also oh, it could be in trouble. That is a punch <laughs> from Kesa. Burrow Strike brings him down. Especially if we gets this kill, he's on the hunt, he's got the troll, so he can net up Exotic oh, no, Deer. Damage. And what do you do against this? How do you play against that? I think that, I almost think at this point they've accepted their fate in the sense that the draft hasn't gone the way that they want. And oh, an epicenter onto Oliver would be huge here. Follow up with an AL, and he is just dead. Oh, oh, he missed the maledict! Ooh, oh no! no. <laughs> Roman, just gonna get gunned down here, Boogie. But, uh, well, kind of accepted that this um, push towers be on the front lines and not be bothered, but meanwhile they've actually found Patos here. This could be a huge kill for them. In comes the Ice Shard, Patos, he doesn't have any form of escape available, and he is just gonna go down. Undervalued as a oh, wow. but here we they go, they're finding it. Exotic Deer, they have that Spirit Vessel on him and the Malediction, he's gonna drop. Now the AA Blast only landed on the creep. Look at Kaysor, he's just being patient, he's still here. Creep wave, especially because they can't push at the moment. It's coming, it's coming. Spirit is dead, so no shenanigans. Oh. Uh, top why was Tusk here? Attack. Okay. He's just and the Radiant Smoke in their base, they want to fight here because they know the Tusk is dead and there's no brew split, so they want to go. There's a BKB Brewery on the giant. Yeah, there comes the Epicenter, oh, wow. they're just dropping everything they can onto Oliver and they take him out before he can deal any sort of healing. There's no Aegis! Weeha, no Aegis. He's really looking in bad place right now. Roman, he's up in the air and he's going to come down with a thud. He is taken out as well and four heroes dead. That's their only opportunity, oh, but oh my god. Oh, tusk, the damage coming through onto the Tusk. Oliver, they on disc, but keeps him alive a little bit longer. The moment that Tusk comes out, he is dead. Now comes the GA. They're doing decent damage to Nisha.